we have given two expression this and this and we have to determine that what is the greatest possible value of this expression from this to inequality yeah so let's just write down this first we have x minus 16 modulus less than equal 4 and what does it imply it implies that x minus 16 less than equal 4 but greater than equal minus of 4 right similarly y minus 6 modulus less than equal 2 this implies minus 2 less than equal y minus 6 less than equal 2 now what we are going to do we have to simplify this two expression in order to get this so for that let's just use two different color and let's just name this as 1 and 2 so from 1 we have minus 4 less than equal x minus 16 less than equal 4 this implies minus 4 plus 16 we can add subtract any number when we have inequality okay so this is 12 and 16 16 will get cancel out we have x less than equal 20 okay similarly from 2 we will obtain this is what given we will add plus 6 to get rid of this okay Four y less than equal eight. Now we have to determine the greatest possible value of this expression, and for that we need minus y. In this case, we have plus y, right? But we need minus of y. Yeah. So how we are going to do this? For that, we will multiply both sides by negative 1 now you know if you multiply the inequality with a negative number then the symbol this inequality symbol get reversed okay that is if we are multiplying now both side with minus 1 then this symbol will get reverse less than equal will be greater than equal similarly here less than equal will be greater than equal minus 4 greater than equal minus y greater than equal minus of 8 now what we are going to do we will add this two okay so if we add choosing a different color for you guys understanding let's just rewrite this in this form first so we have uh, minus 8 less than equal minus y less than equal minus 4 now we are going to add it so 12 to minus 8 x to minus y yes so simplifying we obtain 4 less than equal x minus y less than equal 16 so what is the greatest possible value we obtain 16 so, therefore 16 is the correct answer okay yogurt a contains 490 milligrams of potassium per cup and yogurt b contains 625 milligrams of potassium per cup Video decides to mix yogurt A with B for breakfast.
and one cup of mixture contains 517 milligrams of potassium. What fraction of this mixture is made up of yogurt B? So let's assume that he makes X amount of potassium from cup A and Y amount of potassium from cup B. Okay. So if we construct an equation with this, this two separate amount of uh, potassium from different uh, container, he mixed it in a single cup. Okay. Because he have only one cup of mixture. So with this we can write that x plus y equals 1. Okay. Now for the second equation we have 517 which is the total amount of potassium he is consuming. This is 490 times from cup X plus 625 times from cup B. So we have two equation here and from this two equation we need to solve for Y. Yes. So let's eliminate X from this two equation to Solve for y. We have from equation 1 x equals 1 minus y. Yes. Now if we solve this, This gives twenty seven one thirty five. Simplifying, this is equals one by five. So you obtain y equals one by five. That is, you have taken one by five times of the this amount of potassium from cup B. Therefore, answer B is the correct choice. Okay.